Hey, this is Nikki, and I'm here to share messages that I get from Spirit are for all of us who are all on this journey to love and to reunite with our divine vibrational matches in this lifetime. And uh, I hope all of you are doing okay in this crazy, crazy world at these crazy, crazy times. So stay safe. Keep seeing, sending love, light. Put the planet in a bubble of love and light. Keep sending that healing energy to all um, so that we can remain focused in healing at this time, which is so important. So I'm going to pull a card from the Moonology deck, and then I am going to do some letter requests that people have sent through. So I'm just going to ask what is going on at the moment, and the message is, look at the bigger picture, and you are very close to achieving your goal. And with so many things, you know, it gets super tough before you get to the top of the mountain. It gets really hard before you reach the summit. And that is very much what it feels like at the moment. Like everything is being thrown at us and you've just got to keep on going. You've got just got to keep sending love and light out, trusting in your journey, trusting in your path, trusting in the... Um, holding the vision for the future that you want to see for the planet that you want to see for the love that you want that you want to see in the world and be the energy of what that love feels that's the other thing it's all about how we feel how we express how we turn up on this world and how we turn up and show up every single day so that is the message it is you're very close to achieving your goal go for it keep going keep going keep going so um, I'm just going to share what that is. Now, the letter request that I have um, received are letters number 25, 66, 6, 42, 88, 33 and 58. So I am going to read those from all three of the, um, the Divine Love Letter books that I do. And these are all channeled letters between people's twins their higher selves all messages of staying on track of guidance of support of help of wanting to keep you on this road to love to trust in the path that you have taken as a soul as a light worker as a twin flame soul to soul heart to heart connection so I am just going to uh, just one second because I'm trying to find the page in the book because this book, I always find it really super difficult to find the actual page. Um, so I just want to say for everyone that is waiting for a service from me, then thank you, thank you, thank you. You are also very close to achieving, <laughs> receiving your um, your letter or service or healing or reading. Um I am sending them out over the next few days. So the word Gibeus means bulging and what a descriptive word. And putting this card at any time of the month suggests that the situation you're asking about is bulging with possibility and coming to a peak. But this isn't an ending card with a neat yes or no answer. Rather, you're being reminded that some adjustments may yet be required before you get what you want. Though you're certainly on the right track, which is hopefully reassuring for you. However, there's also a sense that the situation is a bit tense, so don't push too hard. One false move and the whole thing could blow. That's not meant to scare you, it's just to let you know there's a fuse attached to this situation, so be careful if you choose to light it. So now is a good time to review your plans, keep the momentum going as you move towards your dreams. So keep the momentum going as you move towards your dreams so the letters that I'm going to read are 6 25 66 42 88 33 and 58 so I think I will go through from the beginning so letter six these are, I'll do them all from book one first so I want you to know that you have nothing to worry about I want you to calm your mind so that you can live in your heart and feel me inside of you. Feel my warmth in your heart and let my love and the power of our love together guide us both back to each other. It's been a long, long journey, but it's one that we can absolutely finish. And the finish line is oh so close. It's just a matter of focus and intent. Believe in our life together. 
Believe in the plans that we want for each other coming to fruition. Believe that what you think, I think, and what you feel, I feel. We share common goals. We share common aspirations. We share the same lifeblood that runs through every part of us, binding us together and keeping us in tune with each other. Keeping us in tune by focusing on our hearts, beating together as one. <laughs> so, uh, focus on our hearts beating together as one. It always is handy if you are able to close your eyes because then it allows you to really, really focus on the words and they will run through you and touch your soul. So, 33, uh, so 25, this is don't freak out. Don't go into panic mode because I can feel it. I sense it and it makes me nervous. I want to run away and hide. I'm having so much drama at home and I just need to feel calm somewhere, to feel peace inside. I feel like my insides are being churned up and I'm in inner turmoil. Please know and feel me and know that our love is the only true thing that I've ever had in my life. The love I have for you is overwhelming, intoxicating, overpowering and completely and utterly dumbfounding. Like the first time you see your firstborn, a complete immense rush of heart-opening love that never goes away and never fades. Hmm. Okay, so this love never fades. 33. Of course I remember our bubble phase. It's not something that I could ever forget or ever anticipate evening happening, ever, ever, ever in my life. The magical feeling of being completely free, free to be completely who I am, to not have to put on a show or pretense, to not feel like I should be better in any way, to feel loved for being me, just little old me, and to feel that unconditional love and adoration was simply the best feeling I have ever experienced and will forever cherish it and remember it every second of every day and dream about it every night. Don't ever think that I don't appreciate and love you and adore you and want to be with you with every fibre of my being because I do, I absolutely do and I will. (laughs) So I do want to be with you and I will. So, next one is 42. I want you to stop worrying. Worry, worry, worry doesn't get you or me anywhere. Please try to believe in me and in us and what our love will do. Remember what we were like when we were living and loving each other with no boundaries and no fears. In those moments, it was truly beautiful and peaceful and blissful. The waves of love and emotion were so powerful. Remember those times and focus on that feeling. We can feel that for each other whenever we want to. We just need to focus on our hearts. Focus on our heartbeat and think to yourself that my heartbeat is beating at the same time because we are two hearts beating as one. Whenever you feel panicky or unsure, just do that. Focus on your heartbeat and know that I am always there to support you, to love you to free you from your mind, have no doubt. Hmm. So again, the other one saying, you know, just place your hand on your heart and really feel me there because then you'll know that we'll never be apart. So letter 58 is, I love you very much, like a dove flying in the wind. You are my freedom. You bring me back to myself and bring me back to the pure essence of love in my heart. My heart beats for you. I feel my heartbeat getting stronger and it's like a calling to you. I see your face in my heart. I feel you around me and everywhere I look, I'm reminded of you. This love that we have is a great love, the kind of love romantic stories and books are made of. We will make our love a testament of our lives together. Uh, The depth of our love will create a lasting legacy. We are here to change the way people view relationships. Remember that our love is helping to shine a light on the world. Our love is needed. Please remember that. Mm. So really, especially at these times, it's really important to remember that your energy is so powerful to help heal the world. 
that's what we're here to do create a new blueprint of love um, which is making his mark all over the world so 66 is I want you every single little part of you every cell in your body and every thought in your head and feeling in your heart have no doubt in your mind that we are on this journey together we are so together in the heart it's like we are locked together by an unbreakable bond Believe and know that this is true. I feel you. You feel me. I am you and you are me. Together we make each other who we are. One without the other and we wouldn't exist. Know that the depths of this feeling is at the very heart of me. Uncovering my soul and leading me back to you, the other part of me. I love you. I'm in love with you. I want you. All of you every minute of every day. The yearning for our souls to be together again is felt like a drumbeat in my heart, a constant reminder that I'm being called to you. Believe in me, in us. Believe in true love. Okay, and that's 11.11 on the clock. So the awakening, the awakening to this true, true love. And we can help to heal the world with this love. So keep putting that planet in a little pink healing bubble of love and light, sending that higher love all over the world. So final one is letter 88. And these are well, these were all the letters from book one. And tomorrow's videos, I'll do book two and book three. So... Letter 88, final one. You are the one, the one that I want to grow old with, the one that I want to be with when we are sharing stories of our lives together, sitting by an open fire, doing life together and just being together. I've never felt like this before about anyone. That's how I know that you're the one. You're different. You complete me in ways I didn't even know needed completing. I want to do all my adventures with you. My soul is yearning to be in your arms, to feel our bodies wrapped around each other, to feel the eternal flame of desire ignite between us, to feel real passion, to be deliriously in love, with no fear, no doubt. I want to give you all of me, every day, forever. Well, there you go. And the Moonology was, remember, it was you're very close to achieving your goal. So keep going. Trust, trust, trust in your path. And just always know as well that you are enough. Wherever you are, you're exactly where you need to be. So trust in your path. And if you want a healing, a reading, a channeled letter, any of the services that I offer, please do all details from the link. And if you're waiting for something, um, then please know that I will be in contact this week. So I hope that helps. And to everyone, please stay safe. All your loved ones, stay safe. Let's all self-isolate together. <laughs> all right, take care. Bye.